guys and welcome to my dorm room tour so i will start with this small corner here which is the main entrance so as you can see you have a small area where you have to put your shoes before coming inside uh, the room and of course we have a door with a uh, automatic lock so this lock here um you have to actually input a password that you use from the outside and allows you to come inside the room um as i told you we have a small area where you put your shoes once you come in we also put a small uh, garbage or trash can a broom and on this side we have a very long um or tall <laughs> wardrobe where we put our shoes it's more convenient to put them here because it's easier um once you we, we want to go out so as you can see we have a lot of shoes here and we also keep other random stuff on that side and here uh, the detergent and cleaning supplies and we don't really use this part because it's very very far <laughs> nobody can reach it and here we have the light for the room so once you're inside the room there is there's not there isn't there isn't much really there's just like two beds and two discs and yeah so before moving on to this side i will show you the rest of this side so here we have two wardrobes for our clothes one is my roommate's and one is mine this one is mine so you can actually put um a password that you can use to lock your door but we don't really i don't really use it i don't think my roommate uses it either so the wardrobe is really small too there's much you can put here i just put my um suitcase some working out clothes here some bags here and some you know coats and clothes that need to be hanged but there's also a mirror here it's very dirty <laughs> and there's much really so moving on to the side um, as you can see there is bed number one, bed number two, disc number two, and disc number one. And we have a, a, a centered window. It's really nice because it's big, but we don't really get much sunshine because the facade is not really well oriented. But yeah, we are surviving still. There's also a heating system there, and they can use as an uh, air conditioner in the summer. Um, bed this is my bed as you can see it comes with um, a mattress with this really weird material but i don't really like it and as you can see my bedding doesn't really fit but it's okay i'm kind of short so it doesn't matter <laughs> i had to buy my own bedding because they don't really give you that they just um provide you with the mattress my beddings and my pillows i all i these are all mine we have here some storage so we have um storage number one and storage number two i keep here my clothes my pajamas and everything that i have to hide and here we have a small area where you can actually hang your laundry i usually just use hangers and dry them out or you can dry them automatically in the drying machine in the laundry room there's actually a laundry room which is quite convenient i also have another suitcase here and my towels mm, that's basically it for the bedding part now moving on to the desk this is my desk it has more storage here which is super cool there is a lock here or a key that allows you to actually lock everything so once you do this everything is actually locked that's really cool i think so whenever you're traveling or you're so you don't know what to do with your stuff if you're not here you can use this one okay so on this part i keep my like girly stuff <laughs> like i don't know stuff for girls and here i have just random things and on the last part i think i have food yeah i have like extra food and extra tissues and anything extra is here so the bed actually comes with a lot of storage and as you can see I put a lot of stuff here. I have here random um, stationery, 
some books and some art supplies in here i put all my spices that i use for cooking there is a kitchen that you can use for cooking there's only one and another one for microwaving so it's good also put like all the food here and here i have all my utensils and my minion miniatures i really like minions and some snack and some you know dried fruit etc etc here i have my skincare my makeup more books and my laptop and my pictures there and a small lamp here so the desk is quite convenient because it has a lot of storage and i actually put a lot of things there which is super nice so as i told you there is a heater here that you can use in winter for heating they have like a automatic um heating system for the floor but you can also use this this one to make it more warm you just use this one like you have a high one a medium one and a low one and that's how you get warmer <laughs> and yeah we have we have a window here with a nice view but i don't really like this room that much because i don't really get that much sunshine right now i'm using the light so it's not really that great and of course there is a chair um underneath the chair we have um this where you can put your you know um adapters and everything so it's really convenient and there is a hole and you can connect it to the um desk from here so it's really nice it's very convenient you also have another one just um like next to your bed i think <laughs> so you can charge your phone here while you're laying on your bed which is nice too but yeah it's kind of in a very bad <laughs> like condition okay so now finally i will move to the bathroom so of course you can't use the same slippers that you use inside for the bathroom so we kind of got this one to use together the lights here um this one is for the bathroom so this one is for the bathroom and we have the ventilation system if you can hear it because we don't really have a, a window or anything so yeah so once you're in the bathroom, it's really small and really much. There is um, a shower here. It's not really separated from the whole bathroom, which is super inconvenient because the water gets everywhere. Uh, we put our stuff here or here. It's like everywhere. So we have the shower here. This one is supposed to be a, a thing for like toilet paper, but we don't use it because it just gets wet. We have a sink here. A mirror here and some hangers here and we put this one ourselves so yeah there isn't much really this room that's all i hope you enjoyed it and you got a small overview about this room i just want to mention that actually the dorm comes with a regulation that you need to follow and you have to actually uh, respect the curfew they also have a roll call every uh, tuesday from 9 to 10 so you have to be in your room at that time and the curfew is 12 like midnight which is not bad but kind of you know people are really adult here so they don't want to come back that time in the, to their room but still other dorms are have have curfews of one or two and this one is called Kukje Il Khan which is um, international dorm one so thank you for watching and see you next time bye